70 years ago, medicine was revolutionized by the birth of intensive care and the introduction of modern mechanical ventilation. But one of the big problems with mechanical ventilation is that often the patient's not breathing and that leads to a number of really significant complications. It increases the risk of damage to the lungs because the lungs deflate when the patient's not breathing. It affects the diaphragm. The diaphragm, when it's not contracting, wastes away. And it impairs the circulation as well, which creates problems for patients in shock. But we think we found a better way of doing this. We have been able to keep the diaphragm, which is the main muscle of breathing, active continuously throughout mechanical ventilation by use of a temporary pacemaker. And through this, we may be able to reduce the injury to the lung, keep the muscle active and stop it from thinning and wasting and have other benefits to, for example, the cardiovascular system and the brain. This is the potential to transform outcomes for our field by helping patients recover, increasing their chance of survival, helping them get off the ventilator faster and stronger. They get home, back to their families, able to get back to work and have a higher quality of life. It has the potential to really change our field.